50 flow, eating hibachi. I got 10 missed calls, all my bitches mad at me. Ballet Park Designer District, I'm going straight to gallery. Jones feeling me up, phone ringing up. This is your guys' first time seeing me with the vet. I haven't even showed you guys the other one yet, really, or done a video on it. It just so happened I really need to take some photos of this one, uh, especially for business purposes, get them listed, um, and you guys know what I do. So I'm going to tell you right now, the first couple things I want to do to the car um, right off the bat are the rims. So I don't like that silver trimming in the rim, if you can see here. I don't like that at all. So I'm going to be looking for some forge uh rims to replace them i do like those give it kind of the same look uh, but that's kind of like the first thing i want to do is change the rims next thing is i might change the front lip this is just part of the z51 package you get that front lip so if you see a corvette and it doesn't have that front lip it doesn't have the big uh z51 calibers on it hold on boom um and then also doesn't have sport exhaust which you won't be able to tell but it doesn't have this lip either i mean this wing then that's how you know automatically it's a uh regular just stock base model c8 right so the, the z51 package the main reason is the sport exhaust the red calibers bigger calibers the front lip in in the uh the uh wing so um big difference but the package itself is about eight grand to nine grand depending where you're getting it it's about 8400 to 8500 i believe um i don't remember exactly what i paid for it but it's something like that so yeah man this is the car right here i love driving it it's an eye catcher um everybody everybody's always peeping watching you know looking and i feel like i haven't even done much to it so another thing i want to do is this thing is gonna look terrible i'm gonna have to get it detailed i made it worse another thing i'm gonna have to do is change that engine cover so that engine right there that cover that's just a cover I'm gonna get a red one to match the calibers, and that's gonna be for sure a quick mod I get done, right? But as far as that, actually there's one more thing I really wanna change. I already changed it in the, the other car, the other one, and it's the red seat belts. Definitely wanna get red seat belts, give the inside and the interior a little bit of spark to it. So I'll definitely be changing those out. And believe it or not, those aren't that expensive depending where you're getting it. You just order the seat belts from General Motors. It's about 150 each. Uh, and then probably like 170 after tax, 160 after tax. But the thing is, is that they're gonna wanna install it there. And as you guys know, it's gonna cost you a little bit of money to get installed, but they are gonna get it done. They're gonna get it done properly. So you could take it to a body shop or whatever, have them do it. But most of the time, you just want to get these type of things done at GM or wherever. You know, if you got a good body shop, cool, take it there. So those are some quick, quick mods instantly that I'm looking at getting done with the C8, man. And besides that, you know, as far as the car goes itself, I feel like gas isn't terrible on it. It's actually fairly maintainable and actually if you don't know when you get on the freeway and you're just kind of cruising the car goes into a v4 mode and it seems like gas just kind of real uh really holds on to the or really doesn't burn as much as you would think now some people who get these cars um just you know abuse them drive it really really aggressive every day that's just not what i do i kind of cruise i'll open it up a little bit just to feel it, get out in front if I'm in traffic. I don't like driving next to people and stuff like that. But um, yeah, man, this is kind of, kind of, you know, what it is, man. It's kind of what I got. The C8s, man. And um, it's, it's love, bro, you know? And I've never really done content like this with the C8 before. And I feel like I should. I've had them now for 
six, seven, eight months, seven months. So I don't see why I, sh why I haven't put out content. And um, I think it's time, you know? A lot of people are interested in these type of videos and what it's like to own a C8. And like I said, for me, it, it I got two of them. So I get busted both worlds. I got the coupe and I got the convertible. Uh, for me, the convertible is just a little bit easier to pull the top. But most of the time we, when you're in the CH, bro, uh, at least I don't. I don't really pull the top like that. So this is not what I do, you know. So that's what I got, man. I am in love with this car. You know, I don't really, I didn't really post it much on Instagram and stuff like that. But honestly, you know, I feel like I should be, you know. If people are interested in these videos. I feel like I can, I can find myself in a whole nother community as well with the C8 or just with, with, with cars like this in general, this is considered a supercar, bro. It's a mid-engine, you know? So it technically is like a mid-engine, um, just like a stepping stone to an exotic. And a lot of people do consider this an exotic. I mean, look at it, you know? They really hit it on top of, with this one. It, my other one looks like a straight Batmobile and that has to do with a lot with the rims. And um, I just wanna fill in the gaps on the rims. I don't like them that much. These are like the stock rims. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna come up with different ideas and stuff like that to um, kind of implement in my videos. Or if you guys got any ideas for me, go ahead and drop it down below. Or if there's anything you guys wanna know about it or whatever, just hit me down below and I'll get a video out. And yeah, man, I appreciate you guys for watching. Maybe I'll get, get a couple pulls in there. But if I don't, man, I appreciate you guys for rocking with me. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Drop a comment, hit that like button, and hit that subscribe button, and we gone, man. Uh, so as you can see right here, different modes. Right now it's in tour mode. As you can see that, now I'm gonna put it in sport mode. You hear that difference? All right, I'm gonna turn the car off. Okay.